This is Gretchen Heights News and I'm Svenja. Today we have breaking news of a tragic loss. Our lovely teacher Nile has been killed. Our reporter Daria is live at the scene. So over to you, Daria. Just being someone killed here at Frenchham High. I am at the crime scene now. So everybody worry about their lives because they are in danger. So the killer wa hasn't been found yes, yet. He or she is still here. So let's find out more with the witness. Hello. What did you see? When I was walking, I heard some voices and I ended up here. I saw a man lying on the ground with lots of blood. Also, I saw a person who ran away quickly. Did you see a killer's face and was it a man or a woman? No, I couldn't see the face so I couldn't understand if it's, uh, it was a man or a woman. Um, but I saw the killer's face, he or she wore an orange jacket. Okay, how did you discover that the man was dead? I checked his pulse, but I knew from all the blood. Okay, thank you very much. And now I'm going to speak to a sister of a dead man. Hi. <laughs> oh my god, now you... <laughs> he is gone. I can't understand. My brother. I'm on alone now. I sympathize with you. Could you describe Nile as a person, please? He was a very kind and good person. And uh, who killed him? How do you think? I don't know. He hadn't got any enemies. I oh don't know. Dear. Thank you very much. Now I'm going to speak to him. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. I am at Frenchham Heights where the murder just happened. I investigated the crime scene, but I didn't find any clues. And now I'm going to investigate the whole area of French mines, and I promise I will find the killer. Tell me please, what did you do? Uh, I investigate the whole area including forest and uh, I found a knife at the forest which mm -hmm. includes killer's fingertips and I sent them in a lab and then I, look, I looked up secret cameras and then I found where she was. The more positive news are from Kerem. He's interviewing the famous football star Nikita. So now it's your turn. Hello and welcome to today's Sports Live show. I'm Kerem Balitov and today I'm going to interview Nikita Palatny, a famous football player from Team Ukraine. Nikita, welcome to the show. Hello everybody. I want to send regards to my family, to my friends and to my lovely girlfriend. I love you, baby. Nikita, could you tell us when have you started your career? When I was nine. And how old are you at the moment? I'm 27. You Did you take part in the 2014 FIFA World Cup? Yes, of course, and I scored three goals. Yeah. Wow, congratulations! A lot of women must follow you, is that true? Of, yes, of course. I have a lot of women following me. Girls like it. That's it for today's Sports Live show. Hope you enjoyed it. What? Wait, what? No, no way. Oh my god! Breaking news back to the studio. Over, over, over. Here at Robert's house, a massive hornet has terrorized the inhabitants of the Robert's house. Evacuation is in progress. <laughs> As you can see, people are fleeing for their lives. Likely, the BSC rescuers are here. Where's the hornet? <laughs> oh my god. Yes, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> Security. Where is it? I don't know, but it's somewhere there. Rescue attempts has been successful and no hornets were harmed by making this film. Thank you very much and back to the studio. Good night.
Let's see how the weather will be like over the next days. Hello and welcome to the weather report of Friendship. Today it will be cloudy and windy with 20 degrees. You should take warm clothes with you because it can be changeable. The evening will be without clothes with only 11 degrees. Welcome to tomorrow weather. Tomorrow will be uh, in, the, in the morning uh, cloudy and cold, but then the clouds disperse and the sun gets up. The highest temperatures will be 23 degrees and in the, the evening will be cool with a, uh, with a temperature of 15 degrees. Welcome. Saturday will be a good day. Um, the morning starts with uh, starts bright and sunny with a temperature of 18 degrees. Uh, the highest temperature will be uh, of 25 degrees with uh, a possibility of thunderstorm in the evening. So that's it. Thank you for watching Frontem News. See you tomorrow. Thank you.